द सेकेंड इम्पॉर्टेंट फीचर इज थेरापटिक वैल्यू ऑफ द ड्रग थेरापटिक वैल्यू ऑफ द ड्रग विल ऑल्सो डिसाइड अपॉन द सिलेक्शन ऑफ एक्सट्रैक्शन मैथड वैन द ड्रग हैज़ अ कंसिडरेबल थेरापटिक वैल्यू द मैक्सिमम एक्सट्रैक्शन इज रिक्वायर्ड सो परकुलेशन इज प्रेफर्ड लाइक इन केस ऑफ बैलाडोना इफ ड्रग हैज लिटल थेरापटिक वैल्यू हाउ एवर द एफिशंसी ऑफ द एक्सट्रैक्शन प्रोसेस इज अन इम्पॉर्टेंट एंड मैसीशन इज एडिकुएट फॉर एग्जाम्पल फ्लेवरिंग एजेंट लाइक लेमन और जेनिटिन वी कैन यूज दिस प्रोसेस then there comes the next factor which affect the upon the selection of extraction process that is the stability of the drug continuous hot extraction should be avoided when the constituents of the drug are thermolyzed definitely if the active constituents is degraded by the heat we will not use the percolation or hot we cannot use the hot extraction then there comes the cost of the drug from the economic point of view it is desirable to obtain the complete extraction of an expensive drug so that the percolation should be used ginger is an example of this type for cheap drugs the reduced uh, efficiency of the maceration is acceptable in view of all the lower cost of the process in particular the cost of uh, uh, size reduction to powdered state is avoided whereas this uh, is a significant part of percolation next the, the last factor which will uh, affect the choice of uh, solvent selection or method selection that is the solvent it is desired the uh, constituents demand a solvent other than pure boiling solvent or an uh, azotropic continuous extraction should be avoided and it is a percolation process then we use then the next factor is concentration of the product dilute products such as tinctures can be made by the maceration or percolation depending upon the previous factors for concentrated uh, preparations like concentrated infusions the more efficient percolation process is used unless the drug can not be powdered or it is not worth uh, powdering then double or triple maceration is chosen concentrated preparations of uh, which examples are liquid extracts or by the extracts are made by extensive uh, exclusively by percolation with the exception that the continuous extraction can be used if the solvent is suitable or constituents are thermolyzed now the extraction types there are basically two types of extraction solid liquid extraction and liquid liquid extraction solid liquid extraction includes leaching process in which we can use maceration percolation decoction digestion or infusion while liquid liquid extraction include extraction by using immiscible solvents counter current extraction by using the solvent heavier than water or lighter than water here is the detail of maceration